SpongeBob SquarePants is a series that always seems to have an interesting topic brought up within the lost media community. In the past, there have been many SpongeBob related searches, including the debunked missing scene from I Was a Teenage Gary, and of course, Regal Films A Day with SpongeBob mockumentary, which never even existed. Today, we're going to take a look at a much smaller piece of SpongeBob animation, although one that has maintained a steady search since 2013. Despite this continued effort, there are still many questions to be raised and mysteries to uncover when we're talking about finding these lost shorts, because for all we know, we may not have even scratched the surface. The topic we're going to take a look at today is Astrology with Squidward. This series of shorts involves Squidward providing the viewer with a horoscope reading for the different signs of the zodiac. Each sign would also be accompanied by a picture of a SpongeBob character, edited to symbolize a zodiac sign. These shorts first premiered in the early 2000s and ran for only one year before being pulled by Nickelodeon. Shortly after, the shorts allegedly began re-airing on Nickelodeon's sister channel for the mid-2000s and also reappeared further into the 2000s on international Nick channels in their own unique foreign languages. Due to this messy and scattered airing cycle, these shorts were notorious to track down in any regard, never mind finding them in English. As far back as 2006, the interest in these shorts was discussed on the SB Mania forums, and it wouldn't be until 8 years later, in 2014, when the first English short would be uploaded to YouTube. The general oddity of these shorts, as well as their rarity, is something that I think has always intrigued people, and has created that long-lasting desire to uncover them all. But, what exactly does it mean to uncover them all? Well, the current consensus online states that there are a total of 8 shorts in existence, 6 of which have been found, leaving 2 lost in all languages. Based on this theory, it omits the remaining 4 signs from ever existing as shorts. For a long time I sort of accepted this theory and just went along with the idea that some of the signs simply weren't made into shorts. But then, I opened my eyes to really question what information was in front of me. So the base question I want to pose for this video is how many shorts actually exist? To get things rolling, let's start with the known missing segments of Virgo and Libra. Now, I'm sure there are a lot of people watching this video who are saying yes, they obviously exist. Those are the remaining two shorts that have yet to resurface in any form. However, based on my research at the time of this video, I could not find any proof whatsoever that Virgo and Libra actually exist in any form. The only claims you can find online are common unverified viewer memories, which in no way can count as sources or proof. This is actually a big problem in regards to this mystery, because I feel as though the information passed around is absolutely wrong, and no one has ever really stopped to think about what we're even searching for in the first place. Somehow it's okay to assume that Virgo and Libra exist, but the other four shorts do not. And that doesn't make any sense to me. So we're going to have to come to one of two conclusions. One is assume that all of the shorts we have right now are the only ones in existence due to the lack of proof of the others. Or two, assume that every sign was created as a short for the series, and stop spreading the false information that only six shorts exist. Now, obviously since this is a lost media video, and it makes even less sense to assume that only six shorts exist, we should believe that the whole zodiac containing all 12 signs were made, and we just need to find them. And there are a few reasons why we should believe this. First of all, these shorts were allegedly very popular back in the day, as they were rerun all throughout the 2000s on different Nick channels as well as internationally in different languages. On top of that, the animation was very simple, and each short only lasted a short while, so they didn't take too much effort to make. So it wouldn't make sense for Nick to cancel a popular, cheap short series that most viewers enjoyed. Now, going back to the Virgo and Libra rumors, it's been claimed that Pearl and Squidward were actually the characters used in these shorts, and since the common belief is that these were the last two shorts, people wonder why Gary, Sandy, or any other main Spongebob characters weren't used for the series. Well, when we think about the possibility of the four remaining Zodiac signs existing, suddenly there's more room for more main characters to make an appearance in the series. And I really don't believe characters like the Nurse Fish would be chosen over Sandy or Gary if the whole series was actually only eight shorts long. And lastly, let's think about this from a lost media standpoint. These shorts were unavailable for 8 years prior to the first upload, so clearly the series wasn't saved very well and generally speaking it is very obscure. Being so, it's probably not a matter of the last 4 shorts being non-existent, but rather just eluding all traces of existing, since there are so many segments to be found, and old, personal VHS tapes are really the most reliable way in which these were saved. In fact, there are posts making reference to the known shorts as being newly discovered at the time that they were found. So again, it's clear there's no specific set of shorts we're looking for, and it's just a free-for-all that likely contains the whole 12 zodiac signs. With that said, I think there's more evidence pointing towards the likelihood of every zodiac sign existing as a short, over the possibility of only 8 shorts existing at all. 
This is actually a really common problem within the Lost Media community, where a certain consensus will be reached but with no proof or evidence to back it up. I have no idea why people assume the last four shorts didn't exist, but with no evidence for why, we can't come to that conclusion. No doubt in time as more and more people search through their old Nickelodeon VHS tapes, that'll uncover the rest of the series we need. It might be another 8 years before we find that last short, but all things considered I believe the day will come when we'll complete the Astrology with Squidward Zodiac series.